Hello everyone. Hello everyone. Today I'm here to address this private matter, private matter about the WWE turning PG. To me, I think it's a very bad idea. Do you think violence, violence in the WWE would set a good example for kids? Would it? Yeah, sure, but, yeah, sure, um, you, they, may, they may promote, um, this do not try to sit home type ads, but, but, what if they already did? One died from taking a pile driver, one I attempted to do the swanton bomb, and just about kid himself, and you still say, do not try to sit home? That's why this is why the WWE is a bad example for the kids. It's setting a bad example for the kids. First, we got. Now let's let's discuss another matter. CM Punk, the world's heavyweight champion. Yeah, he's straight edge. He's doing his own thing. He's a heel, which is that's good for the company. But what about? But, what about Jeff Hardy? You see, soon, sooner than later, all the, most of the kids that watch Smackdown will turn to Raw because of John Cena. Why? Because their main reasons to watch Smackdown is gone. Rey Mysterio failed a drug test. And Jeff Hardy got sent packing by CM Punk. They were the main reasons for kids to watch. Now, because of CM Punk, SmackDown is losing its young young viewers that are being sent to Raw now because of the X and John Cena. That's why I hate it. Seriously, I mean, why would WWE turn PG when they have this pay-per-view name called Hell in a Cell? How can they have the PG rating in the Hell in a Cell pay-per-view promoting Hell in a Cell matches? You, you see, it's not a Hell in a Cell match without blood. We all know that. That's why no one, no one bought Extreme Rules, because there was no blood. It was all too PG. I didn't like that at all. Come on, WWE. What is wrong with you? But I will agree on one thing, that Rey Mysterio... Pretty much dug his own grave. He um got caught taking some kind of drug. I don't know. I don't know what it is. And probably it probably would be painkillers because because he had five surgeries on one knee and um and he wants to dr drug himself up so his leg can feel better. But this is, but this is, what's the word I'm looking for? It says, reprehensible. So, Smackdown has some, some kitty talent, with crime time and our truth But that's not going to put the kids to watch it. You know, Jeff Hardy is the main reason why kids watch Smackdown. You know, Rey Mysterio is the reason why kids watch Smackdown. Now they cannot. Now they cannot. Now they can't even turn on the TV. Why? He's right let his kids down. He let his wife down. He let his whole entire family and his fans down by taking one of those painkillers.
and I don't think Eddie Guerrero is an excuse for Ray. I don't think so. Since I'm the one who's uploading this video, I'm sending this message. I'm sending this message straight to the WWE headquarters. Fix it up. This isn't working. You know it isn't, Vince. You can't even create new stars. You said yourself that you couldn't. And, uh, and uh, look, at, look what you're doing. Pushing Dolph Ziggler. Pushing John Morrison. If you can't create stars, then release Seamus. Release Tyler X. Release Yoshi Tatsu. I'm just saying. I know the divas are more than just eye candy. Why would you not re replace Candice Michelle for Rosa Mendez? You know, I would prefer watching. I prefer watching Candice than Rosa any day. Why would you want to release Candice? What has she ever done to you to make you mad? If she requested it, then that's fine. But why? Why would you want to do that? Come on, Vince. Use your head for once, man. I'll flag myself if I have to. Because why? It's my heartfelt opinion on the WWE. Why have Hell in a Cell matches when there's a PG rating on? Why have DX when you have a PG rating on? Why would you have... What's the word? Big Dick Johnson when it's PG? You ask yourself the questions, Vince. Question yourself about them. And why did you do them? Why? Look, I know you had your birthday. But you already had it now. I'm just saying this. To express my opinion. About, about this PG rating. You're watering down DX. You're watering down John Cena. You're doing something right, pushing Randy Orton, but Raw's failing. SmackDown superior. Well, was superior until Jeff left and Rudd failed his drug wellness test. And now that the most viewed wrestlers on the SmackDown brand are gone. I would say the kids would turn to Raw for one man, John Cena. I had to say it, but it's true, Vince. I hope you're watching, and I hope you're listening. Anyway, I'm done. I hope you listen to this, Vince. Listen to it carefully.